If Mary were but known. Devotion to Mary is low and thin and poor. It has no faith in itself. Hence it is that Jesus is not loved, that heretics are not converted, that the church is not exalted, that souls which might be saints wither and dwindle that the sacraments are not rightly frequented or souls enthusiastically evangelized. Jesus is obscured because Mary is kept in the background. Thousands of souls perish because Mary is withheld from them. It is a miserable, unworthy shadow which we call our devotion to the Blessed Virgin that is the cause of all these wants and blights, these evils and omissions and declines. Yet, if we are to believe the revelation of the saints, God is pressing for a greater, a wider, a stronger, quite another devotion to his blessed mother. Let a man but try it for himself, and is surprised at the graces it brings of it, and the transformations it causes in his soul will soon convince him of its otherwise almost incredible efficiency as a means for the salvation of men and for the coming of the kingdom of Christ.